it's a new day today. Wow, I need to clean this screen. It probably doesn't look too dirty to you, but I can see a lip mark on my lens because when I suck you guys at the end of the vlog, sometimes my lip accidentally touches the... I gotta clean that. That's dirty. That's gross. Let's start our day. Let's have a good day like we always do. Yeah! I was expecting some packages to come on Monday, but they ended up coming earlier. I got two gigantic packages here, and, or boxes. I know what they are, and I'm really excited. I actually ordered three, but the third one, I guess they had to pull in a back order, something like that, and that's coming Monday, so whatever. But for right now, those two things are these Gigantor Pelican cases. It's super gigantic. Um, these are Pelican cases, 1750s. They got rolly wheels. Um, if you haven't guessed already, these are perfect for rifle transportation. Um, and that's because Brandon and I have recently been planning some sort of trip. I don't know if we're going to Arizona, where we're going, but to go on a shooting trip and at least be able to try out these. these you know, new guns. So, um, these cases do not come pre-cut. And I know that a lot of you guys, if you ever looked into buying a Pelican case, you know how expensive these are. This case alone, one of these cases, runs about $430. I did not spend $430 on this. Because Cyber Monday had a deal that they were doing, I don't know if it's still going, but they had a deal and they were selling them for $180. I could not pass that up because the price tag is the reason I never got it in the first place. And I didn't know, like, even if I go on a shooting trip with Brandon or with any other friends, I can't just put, like, those big rifles in my truck. I mean, I can, but that's not smart. I should put them in a case and lock them up. So, um... I have these. These do not come pre-cut the foam. So, today, I guess I will be doing tactical arts and crafts. <laughs> That's, this should be fun. I actually, I've never cut one of these cases before like this. And after watching some YouTube videos, a good amount of YouTube videos, which is where you can learn anything in the world, YouTube. Um, Everyone recommended an electric knife, so I ordered one of those too, and hopefully it won't be too difficult. This is how I'm laying out the full rifle. So I have the magazine over there. I have the bolt right here, and it should be pretty set. Now, I actually want the rifle facing the other way, but from the videos I've seen, you need to completely reverse everything that you want to do, because you're going to mark up this side while you're doing it with a marker. Once I cut it, after it's all cut, then I take the foam and flip it over. So everything that you see will actually be reversed. Oh yeah, that's showing up. Now I just gotta trace everything out. Got this trace, so now I can remove it. That way, the reason I'm doing that first is just so I can do everything to get rid of the other accessories. I'll do like the bolt and stuff over there so I could just have full access to uh, the rifle. Got it all traced out, and now I'm just gonna need to cut it. So to cut it, I have my handy dandy electric knife. I have the pelican cases on that side, so it's like a weight, and we'll start the cut, because I can't, that has like a rounded top, the um, electric knife. So if we just take this, this knife, and just start it, let's see. Okay. Now, we just take this, I guess, stick it in there, okay, oh god, that's easy, I know, 
say you don't like Harvey. <laughs> okay. So the first few times will be a little snug. Let's see. The magazine kind of sank too low in it, so I took the block I cut out, cut it in half. And if I take this now and just stuff that down in there, it now makes it fit right at the surface exactly how it's supposed to fit. All done. Check it out. I also added a little extra foam in there so that sticks up a little higher because it was sinking really low. But I think it turned out pretty good. I mean obviously it's not like machine done or laser cut or anything like that. I didn't get a custom case custom foam case but for a DIY home project I think it's I think it's pretty good and seeing as how long it took me I'm not gonna do it for the other ones just yet I'll space out my time and I'm not gonna keep vlogging the other ones I'll probably just do them myself but I just wanted to share my first time with you guys trying to do this and I think it turned out pretty good I'm pretty proud of myself Jake is selling his old Super gigantic bean bag, um, and Whoa, so we're loading it up in his. It's a bean bag, <laughs> and we can't. We're trying to fit it in his trunk because we only have his car, not mine. This thing is hey, gigantic. Hey, it happened once. It'll happen again. <laughs> yeah, he got it here in this car, so it has to leave. Somehow we're gonna figure this out. I don't know. This is gigantic. Are you pulling? Yeah. Oh my god, we're getting it. We're getting it. There. It's in! Uh. I'm with Jake right now. Hello, Mr. Jake. Hey. And we're gonna go to the Boiling Crab because. I've never been to the Boiling Crab, but I love shrimp and they have lots of shrimp. because they have uh, boiled crustaceans. Boiled crustaceans, exactly what I want. For my gestations. Yeah. That means. I don't know either. The boiling crab. You enjoying yourself? I am. <laughs> what, what should I draw? A bigger, a bigger one. <laughs> Wait, hold on. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with your dick? <laughs> I got a pencil <laughs> With just like hairs. six really long hairs. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, shrimp and crawfish. I see all that crawfish. The temperature's high. What? The temperature's high. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm excited for this. Empty. Oh, so good. Okay, guys, well, that's all I got for you for today. I figured I'd show you guys. I also got a chance to finish the second case that I have, so check it out. Let's just open this up before I put it all away and lock it up. Whoa, falling everywhere. Anyway, there's the AR, AK. Two extra mags of each. Set it all up. Took me a bit of time, but I'm done. And that's all I got. So, on that note, I will see you guys again soon. Goodbye. I'm just going to stick this in, take a long inhale like it says, hold it for a few seconds, and then let go. Let's see.
You can taste it? Oh yeah. You, it's like, it's not like there's nothing there. It tastes like the liquor. 